St. Louis in Bush Stadium. It's the home opener of this new season between the Pittsburgh Pirates and the St. Louis Cardinals. It's baseball on the show and it's coming up next. Josh Harrison stands in and we are set for baseball here this evening. Pittsburgh, right fielder number five. And a cold strike on the game's first pitch as we bring you this one here tonight. And Harold, we take a look at the Cardinals entering play here tonight. They come in looking to make it two in a row as they were winners last time out. Matt, it's always nice to play at home. And to win the first game of the series makes it even extra special. It's got to go out and play real well and maybe keep the streak going. Here tonight. Center Here's Starling Marte six. coming into this Starling one. He's carrying Marte. a rather substantial batting average up in the 330s. Line drive to left but pretty much right at the left fielder as he takes it in for the second out. Third, Here's the catcher Wilson, Wilson Ramos. First Ramos. chance for him here in the top of the first with nobody on. Swung on and missed for the first strike. Well he's just two outs into his major league debut on the mound and so far he doesn't seem nervous or like he's trying to do too much. That's easier said than done. And one and one as this one's in on the hands. Nope. And That's that one stayed too low, apparently. Into the windup, here's the two and one pitch. Line drive to center field. Pham will get there, and he puts it away to retire the side. Colton Wong will stand in. It lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Leading off for the Cardinals, the second baseman, number 16, Colton Wong. Sends that one out of play for strike one. The wind up and the 0 1. And he jumps at a changeup, a swing and a miss. Wow, great pitch right there, right? Changing speeds. How about that straight changeup? How about that swing? Howdy, if you're waving at me. Lays off that time, and it's one and two. Lifted into the air out towards center field. Marte is under it, looks it into his glove, and there's one gone. Into the box now, Dexter Fowler. First chance for him in this one, as he's got that average pushing up near 350 to begin play. And a curveball in for a strike. One out, nobody on. There's a drive out toward the gap in left center. Heading for second now is Fowler. Fowler around second. He's headed for third. The relay throw, and Fowler will get there. He's got a triple. Now batting, batting Paul. DeLong the average just a few ticks shy of 300 for the season so perhaps a hit or two in this one could put him up over the top fastball in there for a called strike here we are in the first inning we're watching adjustments be made after giving up that extra base hit now that's better location he's going to have a better day if he does that hit hard towards center and it's the Cardinals that'll strike first here and that base hit makes it a one nothing ball game in now, Tommy Pham. One in, one out, and one on here in the Tommy inning. Pham. From the stretch. Swung on and missed. Outclassed by that fastball for a strike. Good job there to jump ahead with the fastball. If he's going to get back on track out there, the fastball is what he's going to start to need locating first and foremost. Then he can work his other pitches off of that. Matt, he's thrown two pitches right down the middle and got away with them. I don't think he should go back there again, but he's got to locate a little bit better if he wants to put him away. This guy's too good a hitter. So he sets Batting him fan. down swinging. Third Tommy Pham becomes the Matt second out Carpenter. of the bottom of the first. Here comes the first pitch. Matt Carpenter is in with two away now as he looks at a called strike one. Now the 0 1. And this is chopped foul at the plate, and he stays alive, still 0 and 2. Well, he's out in front of that breaking ball right there. I'm not surprised. I was after that fastball. Nice job of pitching, kind of keeping him off balance. Bounce to first. 
And he'll step on the bag himself, and the inning is over. And that'll bring up the versatile Jung Ho Gong. He enters play, hitting in the baseman. 260s for the year. And he gets ahead here with the fastball, strike one. Well, Matt, as advertised, he's broke out with a good fastball. He likes to pitch out the fastball, but this was in the mid-90s. We'll see him be aggressive most of this game with that fastball. Oh, that's one he's going to want back right there. A fastball right in your wheelhouse, and you foul it off. Hit on the ground out to short. Throw to first will be in time, and there's one gone here to start the second. Josh Bell the next to hit. He begins playing this one with his batting average over the 310 plateau. And he'll hold off on the slider here to start the at bat. It's ball one. Fastball and that thing got up there at 95 miles an hour a ball and a strike. That fastball was a lively one. You could hear the pop of the glove all the way up here. Yeah, nothing better, huh, guys? I guess maybe the crack of the bat, but I'm not as partial to that as most people. He looks good and loose out there to start this one. And here's a ball hit in the air. DeLong backs up and takes care of it. Two away. Standing in, Corey Dickerson. Not the shiniest of batting average as he comes in hitting down in the 220s for the year. Mm, a little tardy there. No balls and a strike. Swing and a miss just behind a lively fastball. See what happens when you work fast, you stay aggressive, and you come right after guys. Man, you get great results. Two quick outs, and now he's 0-2 on this hitter. Swung on and missed, and that's the final out of the inning. At the plate, Marcelo Zuna. Leading it's been a rough go Lewis. for him at the plate Left as he fielder. enters this one with a season Marcelo average in the 230s. Oh, and he just blows the fastball by him for strike one. And this one's downstairs. It's a ball and a strike. High in the air out to center field. Marte patrolling center makes the play one out. Here's the catcher Yadier Molina hitting a little over 250 coming into action in this one. Good downward action there and it's 0-1. The wind up and the 0-1. Changes up on him but that's in the dirt for a ball. From the wind up the 1-1 pitch. And a fastball runs in a bit too close for comfort that time. Most good pitchers know that they have to work inside and sometimes even come off the plate to keep hitters from getting comfortable up there. I think that was part of the intent with that last pitch. A two and two count. Here's the pitch. Hit the other way out toward right field. Harrison is under it. And he makes the catch for the second out. Set to get his evening at the plate started. Jed Jerko batting just a notch below 300 so far on the season. And he'll try to crowd him there to start the at bat. It's 1 0. The wind up and the 1 0 pitch. And that change up makes him jump a swing and a miss. Well, that's a true indicator he's looking for a fastball in. He wanted to spin the win right there, knock one as far as he could. He got the off speed pitch inside and he pulled off of it. Man, I like the last two pitches a change up and then a fastball. And he's late with the swing on the fastball right there. And we'll have to leave it there as this. Here's David Freeze to stand in. 7 8 9, bottom of the order set to go here third in the third. Baseman, David Freeze. Pitch swung on and hit in the air. Fowler on the run. He's there and records the first down. Riding in, Jordy Mercer. He'll get to take his first cuts here. Took a little off, and it's in for a called strike one. We're seeing him in an absolute groove out there in the mound right now. Retired seven straight, and mechanically, he looks really consistent and fluid to me. Slider taken here, one ball, one strike. Line towards center field. 
But sadly for him, this will head straight to the center fielder as he puts it away without much trouble for the second out. Tyler Glasnow. Swing and a soft liner. Oh, what a stop! He gathers the throw. It's in time. Digging in, Julio Arias. A match up with Tyler Glass now to lead off the inning. And he swings through a fastball and doesn't catch up with it. It's 0-1. Gets the fastball by him here, and he's in control 0-2. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 2 pitch. Swing and a liner. And that'll get down for what should be extra bases. And this will get to the wall over near the 336 marker. And he'll pull into second here with nobody out. Striding in once second again. Colton Wong. 0 for oh, 1 man. for him here in this oh. one. He's set and the pitch. And this one gets away. Throw goes to third, and he's going to make it up to third here as he advances on the wild pitch. He's ready. Here's the 1-0. Now a swing and a ball popped high in the air over toward foul ground. And he'll lunge forward to make the catch for the first out. Trying to pick things up where he left off. Dexter Fowler. He smacked a triple and later scored his first time around. And this is low ball one. Here it comes, one and oh. Swing and a line drive, but this will be a foul ball. A man at third with one away. Hit out towards second. And that's through into center field. Base hit. And the runner from third crosses the plate. Ready for another now, chance. Paul DeLong. Paul DeLong. Here comes the first pitch. Takes a fastball on the inside corner. Runners on first with one down. d -Rod. In the dirt here. Here it comes, 0-2. And, and a wave and a miss on a ball that was way out of the strike zone. There are two away now. The center fielder number Digging 20. in, Tommy Pham. Tommy 0 for Pham. 1 here in the early going. Ball 1. Counts 1-0. From the belt, kicks and deals. Comes in with the changeup, and it's 2-0. and Now with the 2-0 count and the power at the plate, it could be fireworks time. This is the kind of count he makes his money in. Squared that one up just a little late. Well, that got him in the rocking chair right now. A little changeup, follow up with the fastball, and he's a little late with that swing. I may go back with another changeup. He's set, and the 2-1 pitch. Now a 58-foot curveball that misses for a ball. Well, he doesn't have any walks yet. He's going to have to come in the zone right here and really avoid throwing that first walk of the game. Now a throw over to first. And a ball popped foul to the right side out of play. All right, 3-2 count with two outs. The runner on first will be moving, so we'll see what happens. There are a lot of possible outcomes with this kind of play. Oh, and there's the good curveball as he set down. Stepping in and ready for another shot, Josh Harrison. He'll Pittsburgh. match up with Julio Urias to lead off the five. inning. Josh And a half-hearted swing there as he tried to go the other way, and it's strike one. I really love the way he's attacking hitters on that first pitch. It's over 80% first pitch strikes in this game. And that's why he's having such great success. And the Pirates are in the hit column. Oh. 
digging in to try it again. Starling Marte Starling comes into this Marte. at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. First pitch of the at bat on its way. A fastball that just misses inside. One oh count here it is. Pulled high in the air out to left field on the move is Ozuna. He's got it one away. And he will scurry back to first as he'll think twice about trying to move up. up next, now with the play Wilson Ramos. Catcher. He's 0 for Wilson. 1 thus far. Ramos. Now a snap throw to first and he'll dive back in. And a changeup here misses off the corner to start him out. It's ball one. The intent with that changeup away was one thing and one thing only. Get a double play ball. Nice job to lay off it at the plate, though. Chop foul over towards the coaching box. Here's the 1-1. One -one. A swing and a miss at a ball down. He had some really good late action on that slider right there. It's hard to do anything with that pitch unless you're sitting on it and catch it out front before it breaks all the way in. Swing and a liner, but foul. No runs, just one hit, and no errors so far for the Pirates. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. And that nearly would have gotten him on the board. Instead, it's a long foul ball. That's a good pitch right there, believe it or not. You got the change up and you got him out in front. Yeah, he had a foul ball home run, but that's what it is. Foul ball. Oh, and he can't catch up to the fastball as he swings and misses on for the second for out. Pittsburgh. Second baseman, Jung Ho Zhang. Now we'll step off and fire to the bag. Runner back safely. First pitch coming here it is Jung Ho Gong is in for the second time here as he looks at one outside it's one and oh. He's ready here's the one oh. Fouled straight back. Here's the one and one pitch. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Fam is after it. He's there to track it down, and that'll end the inning. Digging in for his second at bat, Matt Carpenter. Over one for Cardinal. him here in this one. Third baseman. Matt and this is just Carpenter. off the outside corner for a ball one and zero. Oh. Backdoor breaking ball just missed right there. It's such an effective pitch if you can hit the corner with it, but no dice this time. Here is a ground ball now for the shortstop to the right of second. No problem here. One away. Here's Marcelo Zuna. So far 0 for 1 with a fly out. Into the windup and the pitch. And he'll look at a first pitch curveball that's in the dirt. It's ball one. Now here's the pitch. That swung on and missed. We're even at 1 and 1. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. A fastball right over the outside corner. I like what I'm seeing right now. In, in, and then goes away. If you pound him in early, it opens up the outside half of the plate. And that's what he's doing right now. Throw to first will take care of him. Score it 2 to 3 on the put out, and there are two now, gone now. Number four. So catcher. bases are empty here Yadier. with two gone. Molina. And here now is the catcher, Yadier Molina. And here's a first pitch curveball that bounces on him there. It's ball one. Now the pitch. Fouled back. Two runs, four hits, and no errors so far for the Redbirds. Check swing, no swing, says the home plate umpire. Ball two. <laughs> Not sure what he saw in that pitch, but it sure looked tempting. It, at least he held up. He must have been guessing. Look out, and that'll give him a close shake. No walks yet. Here's the delivery. Takes a good swing, but this will be a foul ball. Swing and he pops him up. 
over toward foul territory. And nope, this one falls, so we'll get another shot. Something has to give. Here's the payoff pitch. Hit hard up the middle. Played on the backhand. Throw in time, and the side is retired. Josh Bell, the next to hit, comes into this Pittsburgh. at bat 0 for 1 First in the ball game. Josh Bell. First pitch of the inning is taken low and away for a ball. It's 1 and 0. Now the pitch. Look out, 2 and 0 now. You know, sometimes it takes a pitcher a few pitches to get going, but those two pitches weren't even close. Ball's behind in the count, 2 and 0. It's time to start getting locked in. That's a nice pitch right there. He threw him a breaking ball, comes back with a fastball, and now he's late. Now he doesn't know how to adjust. He's kind of caught in between. You got him set up perfectly. Hit fairly well out towards straightaway center. Fam is there, and he has it for the first out. Digging in now, Corey Dickerson. He's over one thus far. Turned on down the line. And a reach, but it's by him as he couldn't quite get to that ball. Here's David Freeze to stand in. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. David Freeze. Here comes the first pitch. And a curveball that started low and broke lower. Ball one. And this is popped fouled off to the right and back into the seats. Grounded back up the middle to second for one. On to first as they get the double play to get him out of the inning. Here's Jed Jerk. And some action now in the Pirates' bullpen. They've got a lefty and a right-hander up to throw. Hit hard to third. And just past his outstretched glove into left, the base hit. So coming to the plate, Julio Arias. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at-bat with another big hit right here. Coleman will grab a bat and hit for the pitcher here. Number 35, Tyler Colvin. And he takes a pitch that's ruled a strike at the knees. Pretty liberal strike zone there. It's 0 and 1. Well, this is kind of the life of a pinch hitter. You maybe get one at bat a game, and it usually comes against a relief pitcher that's absolutely throwing bullets at you. Marte is under it. Makes the play, one away. Colton Wong will stand in. Third trip to the plate for him here tonight. 0 for 2 at this point. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Now a swing and a ball chopped foul right at home plate. Has a look. Now the pitch. Sent on the ground out to second. That's through and he's got his first base hit. He's one for three. Digging in and looking for more. Dexter Fowler. Two for two with a triple on his batting line to this point. And this one's in the dirt. And the runners will stay put here on ball one. Here's the 1 0. And this is going to find the crowd down the left field line. It's a ball and a strike.
Getting a few steps off a second there. Now the pitch. In the dirt here. Runners may have thought about it, but they'll stay put, and the count moves to two and one. Good lead there at second. Here's the pitch. Now a ball sliced out of play down the left field line. Now a bluff back to second as he'll just hold on to it. He's set. Here's the 2 2. Again, he sends it out of play. Runners are at first and second with one away. Hit sharply toward the right side, but he'll barely have to move out there and right as he hauls this one in for the second out. Ready for another now shot batting. now. Paul nice DeLong. Stop. A hit in two tries DeLong. so far. In there for strike one, 0 oh and one. Two down, runners at first and second. Swing and a miss just behind a lively fastball. That is power versus power. Here it is. Here's my best fastball. I'm going to get it up in the zone. I dare you to hit. Here's the 0 and 2. Curveball that time, not even close. It's a big spot, Matt. You know, I like how he's pitching, though. You get him 0 2, you waste one, and now you got to expand the zone still and see if he'll. There's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field, and that one is gone on a two strike count with two away in the inning. Ready once again, Tommy Pham. 0 for 2 with a couple of strikeouts for him so far. Low with a fastball here in the dirt even. It's ball one. Into his windup. Here comes the 1 0. And there's a pitch that just misses the inside corner. We've seen him go down on strikes more than once in this game, so this has been a better approach by him at this at bat. Much more patient, and he's gotten himself into a good hitter's count. Now, with the base is empty, I think he needs to be careful not to just groove one here just because it's 3 0. He's a guy that could ambush you and lose one over the wall. Well, he made a nice adjustment. That was a nice pitch right there, 3 0. Now puts a count 3 1. That was the same pitch he threw 2 0. Well, the first baseman is under it to make the play. Addison Reed play. takes over now to start the sixth the inning on the mound. Number 43. Here's Jordy Mercer Benjamin now. He'll try and get things started. Sean Rodriguez Sean will grab Rodriguez. a bat and lead things off here in the top of the sixth. And he'll start the oh, inning with a pitch that misses off the plate. It's ball one. And the pitch. And oh, looked like ball two below the knees, but it's ruled a strike, and that evens the count at one and one. What a great adjustment. The high fastball in the first one didn't have a good release point. The next one, he's able to put it on the corner, correcting himself as the at bat goes on. I love it. And the move to the pinch hitter will not pan out as that's taken in for the first out. Now, back. in to try it again. Tyler Glasno. Gregory Polanco will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. Gregory Cardinals get the Polanco. bullpen started here as a right handers up and warming. Hit out towards second. Throw on to first two gone. Josh Harrison stands in. He's one for two in the ball game. And this is fouled at the plate. The 0 1. And that change up makes him jump, a swing and a miss. Now the 0 2 pitch. And this ball's chopped foul at the plate, and that'll hold the count at 0 2. Another 0 2 coming. And another foul ball. 
This is just great pitching. They start him off with the slider to get the strike, and then they bust him in with a fastball. I don't know what he's thinking up there, but they really are messing with his mind right now. Lifted in the air to center. Pham on the move. He makes the play, and that'll end the inning. Edgar Santana enters to do the pitching in the box. Number 10. Here's Matt. Carpenter Edgar Santana first pitch fastball swung on and missed 0 and 1 well as demonstrated there that's a tough pitch to do anything with oh you think if you've got a good fastball like he does that location can be really effective it looks so tempting to the hitter but making contact on that pitch can be very tough drilled right back up the middle Rodriguez up the middle flip on by Rodriguez and there's one away striding in once again Marcelo Zuna he's 0 for 2 thus far in this one fly ball out toward left center field Dickerson on the move and he brings it in for the second out of the inning. Here's the catcher Yadier Molina. It's been an 0 for 2 effort for him to this point. Swing and a hard liner to center field. And that finds some outfield grass. It's a base hit. Ready for another shot now. Jed Jerko. He singled in two trips to the plate thus far. Now a fastball. Look out as he has to duck out of harm's way there. You know, I doubt he wanted to get that type with a fastball there. But hey, this is a guy you certainly don't want to let him get his arms extended. He's the kind of guy that can hurt. A knee high sinker. Tough pitch. Strike one. He's set. Here comes the one one outside two and one two out with the man at first. Swing and a miss strike two. Two balls, two strikes. And a sinker called strike three as he's rung up and the side is retired. Here's Starling Marte. He started out the evening Leading 0 for 2 Pittsburgh. so far. Center fielder number six. First pitch Starling of the at bat Marte. on its way. And he's in front of a tight little slider that time. Comes set with the 0 and 1. Fly ball out to straightaway right. Fowler has a read on it. And he hauls it in for the first out of the inning. Here's the catcher, now Wilson batting. Ramos. He catcher. comes in 0 for 2 Wilson thus far. Ramos. Here's the first pitch to him. And he jumps at a changeup, a swing and a miss. Well, he swung right through that on that changeup. The changeup is a tough pitch to swing at for the first pitch because you haven't measured his velocity yet. So you don't know what you're going to see coming your direction. This is line to left. That gets down, and he's got himself a base hit. And that'll bring up the versatile Jung Ho Gung. 0 for 2 on his line thus far. Lofted in the air out toward right center. There to take it as Fowler as that becomes out number two. And he will scurry back to first as he'll think twice about trying to move up. 
the batter. Ready once First again, baseman. Josh Bell. Oh. Third trip to oh. the plate for him here tonight. 0 for 2 at this point. This is swung on and popped up. Crossing into foul territory now behind third. And Carpenter will make the catch to Ladies retire the side. Now at the plate, Addison Reed. He's newly Ladies entered into the ball game, so this will be his first trip plate. to the plate here in inning number seven. Greg Garcia is up off the bench as he'll Greg be asked to get Garcia. something started in the home half of the seventh. First pitch here misses wide, 1-0. And a slider just about gets away from him there as it runs in a bit too close for comfort. Hey, this at bat sets up really good right here, right? Hasn't seen a fastball yet, but now he gets to count at two balls and no strikes. He has to be looking for a fastball right here. And he's retired Second one away. Number 16, Colton Long. A swing and a high drive to right center field. Polanco going back, but he won't have a play. This is down and into the gap. And this will kick off the fence now up against the Cardinal bullpen. And he will make it into third with a one-out triple. Stepping in and ready for another shot, Dexter for Fowler. Two for three right for him fielder. so far, including a Dexter triple. Fowler. Here's the first pitch to him. Ball hit high and foul down the left field line. It's strike one. 0-1, oh here's the pitch. Hit on the ground to short. Throw will get him for the second out, but meanwhile, the run is in to score from third. Digging in and looking for more. Paul DeLong. He'll try and start things over now with the bases empty and two away following the RBI ground ball. Rodriguez. Fields it cleanly. Throw on to first. Gets him and the side is. Sean Gilmartin enters from the pen to begin the frame with a sizable lead with which to work. At the plate, Corey Dickerson. He'll have the first crack at it here as we start inning number eight. Liner towards second. Well, this will be taken in at second base. Good positioning for the first down. Next in now, Pittsburgh. Edgar Pittsburgh. Santana, Edgar. and he's getting. Edgar. His first plate appearance Entering here in the, the eighth Pirates. after entering Number off 29. Francisco Cervelli. Francisco will move into the on deck Cervelli. circle now to try to get something started here with one gone in the inning. This one's down to third. And in the left field for a one out hit. Ready for another chance? Sean Rodriguez. Shortstop. He's Sean 0 for 1 thus Rodriguez. far. There's a swing and a high drive into left center field. Ozuna ranging back to the track. He can't make the play as it hops over the wall. And that's a break for the defense as it's going to keep the runner from first from scoring. Goes the other way with it as this is in the air down the line in left. Catch is made near the line in left, tagging the runner from third. And never much of a chance to even think about scoring there. What a no big batter, second five. out. Second baseman. Josh Harrison Josh stands Harrison. in. He's got a hit in three at bats to this point. Took something off there as this pitch is in the dirt, but handled quickly behind the plate. Second and third, two away. Now a swing and a fly ball. Fowler on the run, but no chance to run it down. It's a foul ball. Looking to keep the shutout in check. Here it comes. Skied into straightaway right. Fowler has a read on it. Makes the catch, and that'll retire the side. You're Kevin Segrist comes on to now pitch now. Open Pittsburgh. Number Digging in once again, Kevin Tommy Pham. Over three with a couple of strikeouts for him to this point in the ball game. Swung on and missed. It's 0 and 1. They've done a real nice job keeping this guy into wraps in this one. No hits for him so far. And what stands out to me is they're going right after him. They're not pitching him like they're afraid he's going to do any damage. 
breaking ball as this runs in on him and he has to step out of the way that time. Well this team they're swinging at everything but that pitch was just a little too far out of the strike zone. And that misses two and one. He's set and the two one pitch. And here's a ball hit in the air. Ramos has a play. Makes the play one away. Now in the box, baseman, Matt Carpenter, who could really Matt use a knock here Carpenter. over three in the game so far. That's lifted the other way out to left. After it is Dickerson. But he can't get there. It's over his head. And he'll pull into second with one away. Here's Marcelo Zuna. No hits in three tries so far. He struck out once. Ozuna. Good lead off a second there. Now the pitch. First pitch hacking here, and that's the first strike. He's going to need to shorten up and get that foot down a little bit earlier if he hopes to be catching up to that fastball. Got him to go after that one, and he's in a quick hole, 0 and 2. Here comes the 0 2 pitch. Swing and a miss, and they'll dodge a major bullet that time. Two away. Now batting. Number four. Here's the catcher Yadier Molina. Yadier he steps in off Molina. a base hit in his last at bat. Now here's a swing and a ball hit well out there toward right center. And he can't track it down. A base hit. And the route is officially underway. It is seven to nothing. Here's Jed Jerko now. He's working on a one for three thus far. First delivery to him on the way. Sent in the air out to straightaway central. Marte is going to have room out there as he puts this away. Here's Starling Marte. He'll try and do what he can to work for toward cutting into this big Center deficit. Jason Mott comes Starling on to start Marte. the inning and he'll have a huge lead to work three. with. Now pitching for the Cardinals. Number Ninth three. inning underway now as the first Amen. pitch is taken for a cold strike. Objective number one right here is finding a way to get on base. So I'm not surprised to see him taking on the first pitch there. Big swing and a miss at the fastball, and he's behind in the count 0 2. And a swing and a miss. Good pitch there for the first out here in the ninth. The batter. Here's the catcher, Wilson Ramos. Wilson Last Ramos. time through was a base hit. First pitch coming. Here it is. A swing and a miss on a ball that jammed him. Faces are empty, one man out. Tough one to lay off, called a strike. Not a bad pitch there with two strikes, but it misses one and two. Looking for the strikeout, here's the one two. Swing and a little blooper to center. Pham sprinting after it. He gets there and makes a fine running play for the second out. Third base for number six. Ready now, Jung Ho Gong. He flew out in his last at bat. From the stretch, here's the pitch. And a good pitch, but he gets quite a lot of it. And in fact, he got more than a lot of it. He got all of it. It's a home run. Josh Bell, the next to hit. He was retired after popping out in his last at bat. A fastball, and he swings through it to fall behind. Man, he's flirting with danger. He gave up a home run on that very same pitch, and this time he comes right back with it in another dangerous location. He better be careful. And he'll make the catch here to end it, and the Cardinals have 